tournament poker players. Over $1 million in guarantees from April 10th through April 22nd during the Poker Atlas Tour at Texas Cardhouse Houston. 16 different poker tournaments, including the $50,000 guaranteed kickoff event, the $250,000 guaranteed mystery bounty, and the half a million dollar guaranteed main event. Want to win an $1,100 seat to the main event? Visit texascardhouse.com backslash poker atlas tour Houston for more details. Welcome in, welcome in everybody to the Texas Card House RGV. I'm your host for tonight, Randy Chavez. Most social media is under Randy Runs It Up. Join us in. Thank you for joining us tonight. For we're bringing one three action, hold them to you from the All American City here in Edinburgh, Texas. Right off to the action we go. We have New York Bob on the button, three betting to one sixteen with pocket jacks. Action back on chaos, making the fold. Back to Celos, who also makes the fold. Got to get to the one last player, and Kike, who makes the fold. Right out the gate, New York Bob waking up with pocket jacks. So we will run through the lineup here in, here in a couple. We did have New York Bob out in seat one. Bottom for 500. Now in seat two, I believe we have White Wizard. Bottom for 300. In seat three, we have Chaos. Who bought in for 440. Now in seat four, we have Ruben. Bottom for 500. In seat five, we have Nidia. Bought in for 300. Seat six, returning back to the stream, we have Fish who bought him for 340. Out in seat seven, we have Chris who bought him for 530. Out in seat eight, we have Lowe's who bought him for 973. And last but not least, we have Kike who bought him for 535. Let's get back to the action. We have Fish waking up with pocket jacks, making it 24 to go. Couple folds around to Geeky, making the call with pocket threes. Chaos gonna go ahead and complete with the Queen Ten of Diamonds. We should be seeing a flop three handed. Off to a flop of Queen 10 4. Chaos smashing the flop. Deciding to go with a check. Action on Fish, who leads out for 40. Pocket 3 is going to find its way into the muck. Action back around to Chaos. Who's going to play real sneaky and just go ahead and make the call? Hands up. Off to a turn, we're going to go. Eight of diamonds. I do believe Chaos will lead the turn. And he does lead the turn, leads big. Does go a uh, shy under pot. Does bet out 200, action on fish. Res relatively easy fold for him. Target Jacks find its way into the muck. Nice hand to Chaos. I'll do my best to bring you guys a balanced strategy as far as theory and sorry about that.
lines are 1-3. Uh, the buy-in for this game is 300 minimum. Every Wednesday from 6 to 10 p.m., we invite our guests to come out and join our join our our table. Jump on the jump on the list. Join in on the action. Chaos with a six dollar straddle. Needed in the big blind. Completing. Los waking up with the ladies does put a big raise, makes it 52 to go. Action folding back around to Nidia, who makes a fold. Los picking up a relatively little pot there with such a big holding. I do want to welcome all the players to the stream today. All but fish are. New players on the stream. Fish in New York. Bob, I'm sorry. <laughs> Shout out to our resident dealer, Alex. Pitching the cards tonight. Ruben with a $10 button straddle. Action will be on the small blind. $9 to complete. She does have the Ace 5 offsuit. Does complete. Action on fish. Getting a discounted rate. Does complete as well. Action folding to Keekin. The ninth seat makes it 30 to go. Ruben defending his button straddle, making the call. 10 7 offsuit. To a nine seven six flop, two spades. Action on fish who smashed the flop, flopping the, the bottom end straight. Kick it with the open ender, raising to one twenty. Action back around to Ruben who has. A seven and a gut shot. Is in the tank and does make the call. Should get an all in from fish. We do get an all in from fish. Fish all in for $185. Action back around to Kike. He's going to have to complete at this point. Is open ended. Does have backdoor spades. Makes a call. who had the $10 straddle makes the call as well. So we will have side action in this spot. One player all in, three going to a flop, to a churn, sorry. Ace of hearts on the churn. Geek it with an open rip, top pair open ender. 
Next one back on Ruben. He does make the call, and they will see the bad news. Two hearts on the river. Geeky taking down the side pot. And Fish will be rewarded the main pot. And we do have blood right out of the gates, chat. Do want to go ahead and invite those viewing from home or anywhere that they're viewing from make it out to texas card house rgv here in edinburgh texas where we do have home of the twenty five thousand dollar bad beat jackpot lose with a straight flush to qualify both whole cards must play and there must be a 25 dollar pot requirement we do have progressive high hands with rollovers from 9 a.m to 2 a.m each and every day monday through sunday $100, $100, $100 high hands every hour with rollovers. Ace is full of tens to qualify. Both hole cards must play. We do have an early bird bonus. In time, two for one, $100 max every day by 10 a.m. Must be purchased at the hostess. And we do have happy hour time from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. where you can play for half the price, $6 an hour. Make your way over to Texas Card House, RGV, where it does pay to play. I am in the booth tonight. Leo, our co-host, Leo Zamaripa, couldn't make it out tonight. But he will be joining us on Friday, which we do have an action-packed uh, game set up for you guys. And we hope that you do join us. It is two five, 500 men Fridays. We will have a second table running out on the main floor, and we will be hoping to bring you a lot of action this Friday, so put it in your calendars. And back to the action, we have New York Bob raising the Jack-8 of spades to 13, picking up White Wizard in the low jack. And, which is in case bringing in Chaos with the Queen-9 offsuit. Ruben in the cutoff with pocket fives, designed to three bet to 35. Should be picking up all, all three other players, and they will go to an RGV special flop, four-handed. I prefer Ruben to just make the flat call there, in position with pocket fives. Off to a flop of jack-6-3, rainbow. New York Bob with a check. White wizard, top pair, nice kicker. Leads out for 55. Chaos folding. I believe pocket fives is going to find its way into the muck. Action back on New York Bob, who did flop top pair with a little bit of a worse kicker. It's going to see the turn card. He is looking for turn cards that will improve his hand, which are going to be a spades, a nine, a ten. That's not one of them. Ace of clubs on the turn. Might go check, check. And it does go check, check. Off to the river we go, heads up. Ten of hearts. Two hundred and fifty-four in the pot. Action on New York Bob. 
does make the check. White Wizard makes a check behind, decides to go to showdown with the King Jack. He's going to see the good news. A nice pot of 254 getting rewarded to White Wizard. I do believe we are seeing the first straddle of the night out by Geek in seat nine with a $10 live straddle. New York Bob, Jack Four Spades. Under the gun plus one, decides to make the call. White Wizard with the King Queen offsuit. Also electing to make the call. Not today, says Chaos, with the ace three of clubs, with the race to 40. Action around to Chris, small blind who makes the fold. Silos is gonna make the fold as well. Action back around to the straddler. Geek it with the 5-3 off, off three, five, 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 three offsuit, I'm sorry. It's going to get spicy with it, and it's going to make the call, which in turn will bring in New York Bob, who will also make the call. I believe White Wizard should be making the call here a lot of the times, and he does. We're going to go four ways to a flop. I want to go ahead and shout out to all those that are watching at home and in the chat. Shout out to Sal, Mario, Victor, George, Fernando, Chino. Thank you guys for tuning in. Action on Kike. Checking. New York Bob with a gut shot. Checking. White Wizard smashing the flop with two pairs. Checking as well. Chaos flopping top pair and continuing his story. Geek it with the call. I'm going to go off on a limb here and say that he probably does not have the 5 3 offsuit. I am getting told it was a misread. We'll get you the hand as soon as possible, guys. Action back around the White Wizard, who does make the all-in play. $423. 303 to call. Action back on Chaos. Thank you to those that are just tuning in. We have a big pot brewing. Action on Chaos. He did make a race pre-flop with the ace three of clubs. Ended up picking up four callers. And this is where we stand. He is thinking. Want to get the chat involved. One, who thinks he's going to call and who thinks he's going to fold. One for a call and two for a fold. Let me know what you guys think. He does have top pair. But he is facing extreme pressure. And he does decide to make the fold. Kika does make a snap fold as well. 
Nice pot to white wizard there. We are only on hand seven, guys, and white wizard's already off to a hot start. He is our big winner so far. Let me know who you guys believe is going to be the biggest winner and biggest loser of tonight's stream, guys. New York Bob with a ten dollar shadow out front. Action will be on White Wizard. Makes the fold. A couple folds. Ruben with the three four of spades making the call. Picking up Nidia, King 8 off, Chris with the Queen 10 off. I believe one more player with the Queen 10 off. Off to a 5 5 10 flop. Checks Chris with the Queen 10 leads out and takes it down. Nice hand going to Chris. Off to the next hand. Wizard with six dollar straddle. Action is on chaos. He does make the call. Media with the Jack Nine offsuit making the call. Close on the button. Queen Deuce of Diamonds making the call. New York Bob, Queen Jack of Clubs. Deciding to tax it makes it 26 to go out of the big blind. He does pick up White Wizard. Holding the pocket, the snowman <laughs> making the call and chaos making the call as well. I'm not sure what exactly what chaos is holding. He does have the ten of diamonds, and Nidia makes the call as well. Gonna go three ways to a flop. Ace five four. I believe Bob should check here. Wizards is gonna check. Chaos checks and media checks. Six of diamonds on the churn is a nice card, bringing in some straights, bringing in a flush draw. Unfortunately for us, doesn't look like anybody has it. Maybe Chaos has a flush draw. White Wizard leading out 35 with pocket eights. He does have a gut shot. Chaos calls. <coughs> We're going to be going heads up to a flop. To a turn, to a river, sorry. Seven of clubs on the river. Does complete the straight for Wizard, who is off to a hot start this evening. 
Let's get there with a straight. Let's see what he asked for. Dust but a big bet. Makes it 311 to call. Chaos does fall. Should have went for some value there, wizard. We are playing one three hold'em. 300 minimum, bringing the best action that we can to you guys on this Wednesday evening, and we will be having a 2-5 hold'em on Friday night, 6 to 10 p.m., tune in, should be a great one, and we will be having blood in the water, guys, mark my words. Have a ten dollar straddle, couple collars, couple folds, and we're gonna go to a flop four handed with some RGB premiums off to a king queen jack flop. Not much for anything for anyone here. Ruben with the three four leading twelve dollars. Nothing but to make the call here for Carlos. Top pair, open-ended. Does decide on a, a min click raise. Makes it 24 to go. Kike, the seven deuce of hearts. He does have heart playing the seven deuce on the button. Folds around. Nice little pot going out to Celos. We are missing some of the usual suspects. Some of the guys have made it out to some of our previous streams here. And I do want to give them a shout out. Can't wait to have some of them back in, back on the table shooting some action. Ruben with the six dollar straddle. Couple calls. Got a 9 8 of spades by Nidia. Queen 10 off by Fish. A King 10 off by Chris. Geek it with the Jack 6 of Hearts getting spicy, raising it up to 16. Just pick up a couple of callers back around the fish. Might have seen something we didn't. Makes a three bet to 76 with the queen 10 offsuit. Should be enough to take this pot down. Or not. Action on the idiot. And she does make the call. Do not take what I'm saying at face value as I will be putting my foot in my mouth plenty of times tonight, guys. Queen 8, deuce flop. Rainbow. Fish with top pair. Nidia with second pair.
Media checks. Fish bets out 48. He is giving her a great price to see the churn, and she does elect to make the call. She is looking for an eight or a nine. Ace of hearts on the churn. No help to no one. Should go check, check. Does not go check, check. Nidia with a check. Fish bets out immediately, 124. Nidia has to let it go. Nice hand of fish. We do have a six dollar button straddle out there by Wizard. A couple folds. Media making the call. Fish making the call with the five dude fall suit. Bringing Chris in with a mystery hand. He does have a four of clubs. He got in seat nine with the ace nine of spades. Send to raise it up to 30. He is our most active pre flop raiser. His PFR is for sure going to be higher than anyone else's at this moment. But it is early on on today's game. So we will be keeping a look at that and see how it goes the rest of the night. Does make it 30. It does bring in the white wizard with the king 10 of diamonds. Fish making the call and Chris making the call as well. Four ways to an RGV special. Excuse me. A64 flop, rainbow. Fish checks. Looks like uh, Chris is cutting out some chips. Doesn't look like 45. I'm going to go out, go out on the limb and say he's either holding pocket fours or ace four. Geek of the pre-flop aggressor. Decides to make the call with top pair. Does have backdoor outs. Can hit a nine. Unless Chris has pocket fours. Fish with a gut shot looking for a three. Shout out to those in the chat. Eight of diamonds. Would have give White Wizard a flush draw, but unfortunately, this just wasn't enough for him to stick around on the flop. Had to make the fold. Chris checks. He can make bets out a hundred. Quick call. Off to a river we go. Heads up. Queen of Hearts. Chris decides to check and. Geek, it will, shit, will check. He does show down ace four for two pair. Nice hand to Chris. I would have liked the bet on the river, even had it been a small bet. Maybe would have induced a bluff. Or maybe would have got a worse hand to bet. It's nor, nor here nor there. We will be going to the next hand.
do believe we have a six dollar button shadow out there by chaos I do believe the Friday game we will probably be doing a rock straddle where if you do a button straddle it'll pass over the small blind and big blind and actually will begin under the gun come around skip over the button to the small the big and then giving the button ultimate last action Ace King three, two spades. We are multi way. New York Bob flopping top pair, nice kicker. It's gonna put out some babies as he likes to call it. Little thirty five dollar bet, thirty dollar bet, excuse me. Actually, the Ruben who makes the fold. Nidia with a flush draw making the call. Should be seeing a, a turn here. She doesn't have 68 left in her stack, so we might be seeing all five. Does turn a gut shot. She checks. Action on New York Bob. I believe he's just going to put the rest of the chips in. And he does. Bet 55. Action back to Nidia. Who is going to make the call here, in my opinion, and does make the call. We will be seeing a, a river here. A five or a spade. No cigar. Nice hand there for New York Bob with top pair. Taking down a little hand of 256. Guys, to those watching in, tuning in, if you are interested in playing in either one of our stream games, feel free to call Texas Card House, ask for some info, get with me, Randy. Randy runs it up on most social media platforms or any Texas Card House manager, and we can work something out, get you on one of these streams here. Wednesday and Friday, 6 to 10 p.m., guys. Put it in your calendars. Leave Nidia is rebuying. We're adding on. We do have Chris out there with a ten dollar live straddle action. We'll be on lows. Let's make the fold. Geek, our most aggressive preflop player, says he wants to see it for twenty. Does a raise. We're bringing in New York Bob and White Wizard. Queen 8 offsuit, King Queen offsuit with White Wizard. Fish in the big blind, making the completing as well, including the action with seven four parts. The straddler completes with the 9-3 offsuit. Multi-way pot, we go to a flop. 10-3-4, two clubs. Fish with second pair makes a check. Chris with bottom pair checks. Kike, the pre-flop aggressor with the ace-queen high, leads out for 100, pot size bet. Couple quick folds from New York Bob and Wizards. Action back around the fish. Is looking as if he found seen something strange. He is gonna make the call. 
Oh, excuse me. He does make a raise. He is putting Kike all in. That should do it for Chris's 9-3. Back around to Kike, who does make the call and says he wants to see all five. He's looking for an ace or a queen. I believe they are going to be running it twice. Kike looking for an ace or a queen. Let's have a couple aces and a double, a couple queens out there. Fish picking up a flush draw with a gut shot on the turn. No goal for Geek on that first one. Fish taking down half the pot. And hitting trips on the river on the second one. Kike seeing the bad news. Nice little pot of 497 going to to fish there. people at home I'm just like you guys I want to see the action I want to hear the table talk I want to see blood geek it reloading for 500 it is early and we are off to some nice action early No straddle in this hand actually will be on lows. It's been relatively quiet this evening. It says if he heard me, it does open it up to 13. Under the gun. Quiet wizard making the call with the 2-3 off. Ruben making the call with the king eight off. Nidia as well with the queen ten off. And Fish with the ten eight of hearts. Multi way going to flop. Ace two three. White Wizard continuing his sun run. Smashing it with bottom two. Does lead out for 20. Unfortunately for him, nobody's really holding much. A couple folds. Carlos does make the call. And does turn a king. Carlos checks. White Wizard leads out. Asks for 50. Carlos calls to a Jack of Spades. It is a scary card, but it does go check, check. White Wizard picking up a pot of 208. He is running hot. He is up over 700 within about 15, 16 hands. 15 hands. Nice little pot to him there. Let's go, chat. Get active. Let me know who you guys think is going to be the big winner of tonight's stream and who's going to be the biggest loser.
couple folds around. Ruben with the pocket tens, making it 15 to go. Lowe's completing out of the big blind with the King Deuce offsuit and White Wizard coming along with the 9 5 off. Three handed going to a flop. 993. Nine, I'm telling you, continuing his sun run, White Wizard smashing the flop with trip nines. Goes check, check. Ruben bets out for 25. No need other than to call, in my opinion, but we will see what White Wizard will do. And he does make the call, electing to slow play his strips. Eight of hearts on the turn. I don't see any other reason. Maybe lead small. He does check. Action on Ruben, who does decide to check back. Found something strange. It's a great river. White Wizard who checks and Ruben checks behind. And I think he should have went for a small bet there. Maybe got some 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 thin value if can't just be betting the nuts. I would have liked a small bet from White Wizard there. Do have a straddle on one three ten action will be on the wizard wizard does have some some fans in the chat does have some cheese head fans in the chat guys shout out to those in the chat guys once again we're thank you for joining us on this lovely wednesday night we are bringing you a action-packed one three hold'em game does play does let you know we are in texas guys so the game does play a little different At a ten dollar straddle, couple calls. Ruben raking a raise. Can't see his both hole cards, but he do see a seven of diamonds. Fish electing to make the call with the eight nine offsuit. New York Bob under the gun making the call with Doyle ten deuce. White Wizard getting in there with the nine five of diamonds. Chaos six seven of hearts multi way flop. Ace, King, Queen, Rainbow. Actions on New York Bob. Goes with the check. Wizard leading out for 60. Has shown down nothing but nuts. Is playing his table image as of right now. I like the bet. It does have backdoor outs. Ruben making the call with the seven of diamonds and a mystery hand card head up to the turn jack of spades actions on white wizard Might be shutting it down. Let's go with a check. Ruben checks. Queen of Spades on the river. Completing the backdoor flush. Neither player holding a spade. Action on White Wizard. Did lead out 60 on the flop. there was ever a better time it'd be now and he does bet 311 dollars 
max pressure on Ruben. I don't see him making the car unless he has a 10. I believe White Wizard did show his hand. Let him know he's here to play. He's not only playing the nuts. Was on a sun run for the first 15 hands. Biggest winner of the night so far, but we do have a couple hours left in us, guys. Nice hand. Wizard. One, three. How long will it take us to get a straddle restraddle? How long will it be, guys? Let me know in the chat what you guys think. Do you want to see some straddle restraddles? Because I do. around Lowe's with the nuisance raise as we call it making it six dollars but New York Bob isn't having any of it the ace jack of offsuit in the big blind decided to make it 20 excuse me guys the double flush draw New York Bob with the ace jack off suit. Green and Chaos, King 8 off. Ruben with the six of clubs and a mystery card. Multi way to a flop of Queen Jack 8. Rainbow. As of what I can see now, New York Bob flopping the best of it. Second pair, nut kicker. Action on Chaos. Couple quick folds. Media, second pair. She got backdoor outs. Does make the call. We'll be going heads up to a turn. She is looking for a five or a club. Eight of spades on the turn. Action on New York Bob. There's 186 in the pot. Does make the check. Needy are sitting on 139. Got a pot size bet left. Three of diamonds on the river. New York Bob asking for 60. Yeah, it's thinking. Let's go ahead and make the fold. And Bob will be picking up a pot of 246.
and there we go. We have a straddle restraddle. 10 20. So poker gods have heard my prayer. Where well, we have blood in the water, my friends. We have chaos with the ten dollar butt uh, straddle and Ruben with the restraddle for twenty. Action on Nidia. Holding pocket tens. Does elect to make the call. Fish sitting with pocket nines right behind her. Don't see fish just flatting. He is cutting out some chips to make a raise. Makes it 70. Double folds. New York Bob with pocket twos does not want to go set mine. The price was just not right for him. Does let him go. Switching back around to Rubik, who did have the $20 straddle out there, sitting on the King Queen offsuit. Does decide to rip it for 291. He is going to see all five. Nidia with pocket tens making the call and Fish making the call as well. Three way, all in. Hand 18. Gotta love Valley Poker. Those that are just tuning in, guys, we have a big pot brewing. Three-way all-in, pre-flop. Let me know who you think is going to come out on top. I believe they decided to run it twice is what it sounded like. We are going to get two full boards. We do have king-queen off, pocket tens, pocket nines. Big pot brewing. BPR. Let me know who you guys think is going to win this hand. King, queen off, pocket tens, pocket nines. King, queen holding some equity, some overcards to those pairs. Off to a queen jack six. To club board. Turn seven, no help. Ace of hearts. Ruben sneaking away with half the pot minimum. He knows he's getting back half. Second board. Queen eight deuce. King. Six of hearts. Ruben should be making away like a bandit. Top pair. Out flopping both, both pairs on both boards. Nice hand, Ruben. And welcome to the Wednesday stream, guys, here at Texas Art Card House RGB. Once again, I'm your host for tonight, Randy Chavez. Randy runs it up on most social media platforms. Have questions about how to join in to the stream game? Let me know, and I will do my best in answering any question or concern you have, guys.
reach out to management here at Texas Card House RGV and get your name added to the interest list on Poker Atlas. I'll go ahead and take the time out. Guys, we are running our Poker Atlas tour out at Texas Card House Houston. Started today, April 10th through April 22nd. 16 events, over a million in guarantees, guys. You can win a seat. Click the link, fill it out, click, fill out the form, and head on over to come and play, and they will let you know. Head out to over to poker to uh, Texas Card House Houston for the Poker Atlas Tour. Over a million in guarantees, guys. Back to the action. We have a $10 button straddle by New York Bob. Chaos defending his big blind. Off to a king seven six two club board. Couple checks, action on lows with the ace jack offsuit. Peaky with a jack nine. Bob, who originally had a straddle, wants to go ahead and find out where everyone's at. He does have second pair, queen kicker. Couple folds, actions on to fish. Makes the call. <coughs> Head up, going to a turn. King six seven flop. Fish holding pocket fives. New York Bob with the queen seven off. I believe the turn should go check check. River ten of clubs completing the front door flush. Fish decides to check and I don't see anything else other than checking back. So New York Bob will show down those sevens. We did get one hand of the straddle restraddle and did see a multi way all in pre flop pot. Let, let me know if you're like me and do want to see some big pots, some straddle restraddle. Chaos with the 10 9 of diamonds. He likes to make the flat out of the small blind. with the king jack off making the call as well new york bob in the cutoff in position decided to make it 20 with the king four of spades chaos making the call and ruben making the call as well Action back around the fish, holding the 9-7 off. Decides to make the call as well. White Wizard in there. Trying to continue his sun run with the 6-2 of hearts. He does have the button and did have the straddle. Dust pop bottom pair. Action is on Chaos. Has backdoor diamond outs. Check, check. Checks around. Back to the pre-flop aggressor. Does out does flop two pair. 
White Wizard, snap call. And Roman with uh, King Jack making the call as well. So we're going to go three ways to a churn here. Everybody has something. Check. Action on New York Bob. 190 in the pot. Does lead for 90. Shy of half pot. I do think it is going to be tough for Ruben with the King Jack to get away from this hand. He does know that New York Bob is active, especially pre flop. does need a jack or a seven to win. He does make the fold. Nice hand in New York Bob who does show. Courteous to the table. So back to the action we go, guys. We did have a $6 straddle, multi-way pot pre-flop, monotone board on the flop, jack-9-5, all diamonds. Did check around, and bingo bongo, we have action on the churn. White Wizard with a $15 bet, Chaos with the call. Media making the call, making a raise to 90. She does have two pairs, 10 5. Is protecting her hand. I do like the bet. Nice hand, Media. Wasn't going to let the diamond slow her down. Once again, I want to go ahead and thank the viewers out at home for tuning in on this beautiful Wednesday afternoon, evening, 
tuning into our one three hold 'em 300 min stream game guys every wednesday from 6 to 10 p.m you are more than welcome to join us we do have a couple tables running out on the main floor along with some of our promos we do we are the home of the 25k bad beat jackpot news with a straight flush to qualify both whole cards must play there is a 25 dollar minimum pot requirement we do have progressive high hands through the month of april from 9 a.m to 2 a.m hundred dollar rollovers every hour aces full of tens to qualify the first payout will be at 5 p.m we do have an early bird bonus to those that do want to um, get get some um, promo for the time. The two for one, hundred dollar max every day at 10 a.m. Purchase it at the host desk, guys. And we do have happy hour from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Six dollars an hour, guys. It does pay to play here at Texas Card House RGB. My name is Randy Chavez. Randy runs it up on social media platforms. I invite you to come on over, make your way out here, make plans, jump on the Poker Atlas list, and come and play with us. Here we got the action and a couple of checks through out to the river, the Ace of Spades, guys. Fish holding King 10 off. Chris holding the King 10 off. They are chopping, but they don't know that. I'd say first to bet wins. Max pressure. Action is on fish. Who is thinking? And he does make a bet. Does show him one card. I believe he showed the 10. Nice hand going to Fish's way. Sitting on the ace king, offsuit, under the gun, decides to just limp. White wizard coming in with a 7 4 off. And we'll have a couple people limping through. Nina with pocket sevens decides to make the call. Chris in the big blind with the king eight offsuit decides to make it 23. Your royal airness to call. I'm going to hear the bad news. Carlos, who's been our quietest player of the night. Three bit to 128. Let's fold around to Nidia, sitting on the sevens, 358. And it's trying to piece what's going on in this hand. Low stint limp for three. Limps around. The big blind makes it 23. Lowest with a three bet. Makes it 128 to go. He is telling a story and she does believe him. Action back around the fish. 10 3 offsuit. Should find its way into the muck. Action back around to Chris. He's going to make the fold. Nice hand there for Lowe's. Ace King offsuit.
back to the action. Kike, under the gun with the Jack-10 offsuit, decides to make it 10. New York Bob, uh, rebet to 35 with the King-9 of Diamonds. Trying to catch up to Kike's pre-flop frequency, raising frequency. Action around the fish on the button with the seven five of spades, making the call as well. We should be going three ways to flop here. Checks. Bob continuing his aggression. Asking for 80. Fish with bottom pair and a gut shot making the call. Second pair, sorry. Four of diamonds on the turn. see New York Bob continuing the story here. He did pick up diamonds. He does have two overs. And he does bet out 165. Action's on fish with the second pair. Fish does decide to ship it all in for 615. So far, the biggest pot of the night. New York Bob does make the call. $1,499 in the middle. New York Bob with two overs and diamonds. Fish with two pairs and a gut shot. But he is ahead with the five. sure if they're going once or twice chat got some shout outs to the dealer that is Bob stack in the box throwing out the cards fish with the rivered seven should be good for half the pot. I believe they did decide on going two to two rivers. So we'll be seeing another river here. Jack of hearts, no help to Bob. Fish with the biggest hand of the night, $1,499 going his way. Oh, excuse me. It was a misread. New York Bob has King Eight of Diamonds, not King Nine of Diamonds. The biggest part of the night heading over to New York Bob had two pairs of flush draw versus fish's second pair gut shot wow nice hand going towards bob there who did flop the world and held I 
I do apologize for the misread, but we are working out the kings. Couple calls. Action on fish, who I believe just reloaded for a thousand, makes the call. Yeah, he only missed the one hand. Two more to complete to Lowe's with six three of diamonds. King four deuce rainbow board. Let's check around. Five way action. Seven of seven of spades on the turn. Peek and picking up a flush draw with bottom pair. Feeds out for a ten. It's good enough to take it down. What's your definition of running good in poker, guys? I'd like to know it. Not only do you have to get the cards, but you have to hold and have to hope that your opponents also get just something good enough, right? It's the beauty of poker. We do have 10 out front by Chaos. It's been relatively quiet for the last 30, 40 minutes or so. Six dollar straddle. I believe that Ruben made it 12 to go. White Wizard completing with the Ace Five offsuit. That's fifty two in the pot. White Wizard, I mean, Chaos deciding to make it sixty nine to go. should be finding its way into the muck and it does fish does make the call with pocket fours and we will be going head up to a flop make your way on over guys we have a thousand dollar free roll running out on the main street on the main floor as well Chaos, ripping it all in with the Jack-10 of clubs. Fish, calling with bottom set. 362 in the middle. Chaos looking for a club. Fish looking to hold. We will be seeing all five guys. Off to a turn we go. King of spades. No help to no one. Ace of spades. Giving Fish the boat. Yeah, I'm 
nice little pot there to fish. He was playing well on his first buy-in, mixing it up, building up his stack. Got into a big hand with New York Bob. And, well, as we like to say, the rest is history. Did win a nice little hand there. I believe he probably is close to, if not even on. As of right now, but we do have about another two and a half hours of gameplay for you guys. And Thank you to those that are just tuning in. We do have our 1 3 Texas Hold'em 300 men stream table running every Wednesday from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. I invite you guys over to play. Shout out to David in the chat asking if he can play on the live stream. Sir, make your way on over. Shout out to shout out to Ashley, JC, TJ, Sandy, Sal, and Crystal. So we got some action here. New York Bob on the six seven, White Wizard with the five three of diamonds, and now we had one more. I believe, I'm not sure who it was, sitting on the Queen Jack. I do believe he did outflop him. Ruben with the Queen Jack of Clubs. Couple of checks. New York Bob. Being spontaneous out there, the gut shot. He is drawing dead at this moment. Ruben with top pair. And if the gutter does come, he is looking a lot better with his straight. King of Diamonds on the river. Off to Ruben, who decides to check, giving New York Bob the rope to do as he pleases with the seven high. New York Bob gives up. Ruben taking down a pot. 161. 
Six dollar straddle. Roman makes a call. Nia makes a call. Race with the nine eight off. Making the call as well. White wizard with jack eight. Off suit. Going to a flop four ways. King nine three. No help to no one. Chris. Second pair, eight kicker out in front right now. He does decide to check through. Four of clubs. Couple of checks, Ruben. Chris with the $20 bet. Second pair, Ruben making the call with pocket sixes. Off to a river we go. Ruben looking for a six and a six only. No cigar, 10 of clubs. Does complete the backdoor flush draw. Could rep a couple of different hands, but it does go check, check. Chris shows down the eight, nine off. those tournament players out there who are watching we do have tournaments here at texas card house we do have super turbo tuesdays every tuesday at 7 p.m it does have a 1k guarantee it's a hundred dollar buy-in 15k starting stack unlimited rebuys through the first three hours 10 minute levels every wednesday we have a thousand dollar free roll starting at 7 p.m it's a 1k starting stack $20 rebuys for $2,500 in chips, unlimited rebuys for the first two hours. And every Saturday night, we do have Saturday Night Fever, 6 p.m., 3K guarantee for $120, 25K starting stack, guys. Unlimited rebuys for your first three hours of that tournament. And let me not forget, at the end of the month, we do have a 25K tournament. It's a 25K guarantee. 10K guaranteed to first place off of a $100 buy-in. Write that in your calendars and make your way over. Day one will begin on 424, and we will, we will be having a couple starting flights on 424, 425, 426, and 427. 8% out of each flight will advance to our day two, which will be held on 428 at 4 p.m., guys. Put it in your calendars. Make plans and make your way out here. Spin up $100 to $10,000 in our 25K guaranteed tournament, end of the month tournament, guys. Let's get back to the action here. We do have an Ace King 7 board, rainbow, multi way action. Does check around, nine of spades on the churn. Action is on Nidia, holding the 8-9 of clubs. Fish with the second pair, Jack Kicker, with the snap call. And Bob making the call as well, looking for a 10. No cigar. 
Let's go check, check. Action on New York. Bob does decide to give up. Let's check around. Fish showing down King Jack of Hearts. Good enough to take down the 180 in the pot. Once again, to those tuning in, we do have a nice lineup for you today. Out in seat one, we have New York Bob. In seat two, we have White Wizard. In seat three, we have Chaos. In seat four, we have Ruben. In seat five, we have Nidia. In seat six, we have Fish. In seat seven, we have Chris. In seat eight, we have Los. And in seat nine, we have Geekin. Don't forget, guys, if you are interested in playing, we do have an interest list on Poker Atlas. You can add your name to the list, make your way over, give us a call, and we will build a table accordingly. But we do want to see you guys come making your way out here and signing up for this game. It is action-packed every Wednesday, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. You are interested in playing in it reach out let us know and we will do our best to accommodate we are multi-way here going to a flop guys off to an 886 board we do have new york bob out in front with ace high let's check around White Wizard putting out 30. And it's the biggest winner of tonight so far. Chris making the call with the 7 4 of hearts is looking for a 5. Is on the gutter. Jack of Spades on the turn. Leave action should go. Check, check. White Wizard asking for 40. Action back on Chris. Forty should be enough to do it. Nice hand going towards White Wizard there. Guys, I do want to remind everybody on Friday we do have a two five no limit hold'em. At 6 p.m., we do have a nice table. We are hoping to have a second table running, guys. So make your way over. Nice lineup if you want to see good poker, good action. Join us this Friday at 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. Let's cross our fingers and pray to the poker gods, guys. Let's get some straddle restraddles. Earlier in the day, the one reshuttle we had, we did see a multi-weight all in pre-flop. New York Bob with the seven eight of clubs, making it fifteen to go. By a wizard behind them with the snap call with the king ten offsuit. Ruben with the ace queen. In the hijack, signing to just make the flat call. Turn, bringing Edia with the king eight of hearts and fish with the ace deuce off suit. Multi way to a flop. Deuce five three, rainbow. Fish out in front with bottom pair and a gutty. 
King of Diamonds on the turn. White Wizard. New York Bob checking. White Wizard asking for 20. Ruben making the call. The ace high. Nidia will also turn to King. Decides to raise to 75. A couple of folds. Should be enough to take it down. Nidia with the aggression taking down the pot. Nice hand going to her. I do believe that Chris has a $10 button straddle. Actually, will be on loads in the small blind. <laughs> Couple folds. White Wizard with the 10 9 offsuit making the call. Ruben with the king five of diamonds decided to make a raise to 25. It's getting frisky. I would have liked to see a bigger bet there, in my opinion. It's easier for me, though. I can see the cards. Both Chris and White Wizard decided to make the call. Three ways to a flop. King seven three, two hearts. Ruben, twenty dollar bet. Couple of folds, it's gonna take down the pot. Button didn't get moved. There was a miss steal. Shout outs to Bob in the box. Bob Stack pitching out the cards for you tonight. Bob Stack, Bob Stack, and Little Alex. Oh, baby, we have a six, twelve, twenty-four. Spicy. The poker gods are listening to me. Only if they did the same when I was playing. <laughs> Action on Nidia, 24 to go. Looking at King Deuce of Diamonds. Did have the sure why not look. Does make the call. Fish with the pocket sevens. Electing to make the call as well. I would have liked a, a raise from Chris in that spot. Cool. Oh, maybe not. Our quietest player of the evening sitting on the butt and waking up with pocket queens. Assigned a raise to 100. There is 94 out there. Couple quick folds. Action back to Nidia. Mm -hmm. 
food. And Fish, who was anxious to get some chips in the pot, does make the call as well. So we will be going heads up to a flop. Pocket sevens versus pocket queens. Queens in position. And out front right now. It does bring an ace. Should slow down the action. Action out on Fish. Fish does check. Low spets a hundred. And fish does relinquish. Close. Taking down the pot with the ladies it doesn't show keeping his um, play under wraps for now it's taking a tight and aggressive approach to the tonight stream game Six under the gun. Action will be on Ruben. <laughs> Chaos. Six dollar straddle. Couple folds around. Action on fish. Likes to make the call with the ten seven offsuit. Who just won a hand with the ladies making the call with the king jack off in position out on the cutoff? I would have liked to raise from that hand. That's going to go ahead and bring in Kike, who's sitting on the button with the five deuce and allowing the swan the big to complete. Multi way to a flop. Eight, seven, four, two hearts. I see uh, New York Bob has a gut shot. White Wizard has top pair. Not much for chaos. Fish, second pair, 10 kicker. Not much for Lowe's. Yeah. There's a call by New York Bob. The 10 would be a devastating card for Fish as he would turn two pairs and Bob would turn. The nut straight. Bob turning top pair, deciding to check it. White Wizard putting out 35. Fish making the call. Does pick up outs there. Does have third pair with an open ender. And Bob makes the call with top pair. Does complete the hearts. We are going to a river three ways. Ace of Diamonds, no help to no one. It is interesting to see how this river card is going to play out. And it does check around, and New York Bob is going to take down the pot. 180, heading his way. Is it me or does did I see Richard and Baby Spider from last Friday's stream have the same I think they have the same barber. Small big, we do have a straddle out front. Media.
Let's make the call. A couple of folds around to kick it. The cutoff will decide to pump it up to 17. Ruben, who had the six dollar straddle, says, Uh uh, not having any of it. And that's three bet to 40. Want we'll to see something we don't? Action back around the Kike holding the 8 6. It's dominated by Ruben's 10 8 as of now. It is interesting to see what's going to go down post flop. Jack 10 4. Let's go check, check. King of spades on the turn. Geek it holding the only spade. Let's go check around on the turn. I would have liked the bet from Geek on the turn. He could rep straights, two pairs, and flushes. It would have been hard for Ruben to continue with third pair there. But we do get to the river and it does go check, check. And Geek will see the bad news. Ruben taking down a pot of 90. Out in the chat, I have uh, Fabian asking if Los is in seat seven. No, out in seat seven is Chris with a gray hoodie. Los is in seat eight wearing the... Wearing the green button-up and United States Marine Corps hat out in seat eight. have action was raised by New York Bob to 25 with the 8 5 of diamonds and he did pick up quite a bit of callers off to an RGB special flop multi way queen 10 5 two hearts let's check around eight of clubs on the turn Does give New York Bob the best hand with bottom two. Chaos checks. Ruben bets out 20 with the flush draw and third pair. Nidia in there with a gut shot. With an open ender, I'm sorry. Looking for a nine or an ace. Coming along. And Chris coming along with the ride. Turning, turning the nut flush draw as well. So we got the nut heart draw, the nut club draw, an open ender. And bottom two pairs. New York Bob raising it to 120. In position, last to act. Action back on Ruben, holding third pair in the nut flush draw. Who makes a call? Nidia lets go of her hand. Action back on Chris. 
We'll turn the club draw. Looking to go runner, runner. It does make the call. And just like that, we have 508 in the pot. Did I mention it's a 1 3 hold'em game? Six of diamonds. No help to the flush draws. Bob with bottom two. Should go check, check, bet, fold, fold. Bob does check and goes to showdown. Nice hand there for New York Bob. Wrapping the NY. Shots out to Nick, the AGM. with the $10 button straddle. Ruben making the call with the 10-9 of clubs. Action on fish. Getting advantageous there with the 3-2 offsuit, making it 39 to go. Chris with the ladies. Put in the three bet. Looks like he three bet to 100. Couple of folds. I think I believe Los instantly threw away the ace jack suited. Not a doubt in his mind that it was no good. Chaos letting go of his straddle. Ruben letting go of his. Action back on Fish, who made it 39. Who makes the call? Heads up to a flop we go. Off to the races. Jack 6-4. Fish with a gutty. Chris being sneaky decides to check. I don't really like that check. Bringing in the king of diamonds on the turn. Fish leading out for 25. Chris decided to make the call. Lost value there. Four of diamonds on the river. $167 river bid. Action on Chris. He's putting Chris all in. Gonna put Chris in the pressure cooker. Chris making the call. Non believer. We'll see that his queens are good. Shout outs to Juan Boo Boo out in the chat. Chino. Hope all is well. Thank you guys for tuning in.
Chris taking down the nice little pot there of 607. It's getting relatively short. Didn't make a big call on the river there. This fish was putting in the all in bluff on him. Did sniff it out and did make the call. Once again, guys. I do want to invite everybody out to our Poker Atlas tour out in Texas Card House, Houston. It started today, April 10th through April 22nd. There is 16 events, over a million dollars in guarantees. Make your way over there from now till the 22nd of April, guys. Ruben with a $10 button straddle. Actually, will be on Nidia holding the Jack 3 of Clubs. Does look like she is going to complete. Fish, our most active player, is completing as well. A couple of folds out to Kike holding the Queen 9 of Spades. Was er active early on, decides just to make the call. New York Bob folding. White Wizard coming along for the ride with the 6-7 offsuit. Action on Chaos, who's been relatively quiet, has a reloaded stack, says, uh-uh, makes it 70 to go. Couple of folds. Fish with the 8-6 offsuit. Going to get jiggy with it. Slot on Chris makes the fold. He can make the fold. We will be going heads up to a flop. King Jack offsuit versus eight six offsuit. Shots out to St. John in the chat. John Andre, the Cajun Asian, and Leon Quells. Shout out to you guys. Come on in, play on our main floor, guys. Off to a flop of A75, two clubs. Fish dust check, chaos bets, fish calls. Queen of Diamonds on the turn. does go check check to a deuce of diamonds on the river and fish does elect to shove all in here with his open ender and does take down the pot show it decides not to show it i'm sure chaos will be out on his phone in 15 20 minutes looking at that hand Appreciate the shout out, John Andre, the Cajun Asian out in the chat, guys. We got the Cajun Asian not able to make the table today, but he is in the chat and hopefully will be active. Let's cross our fingers, guys, and hopefully we'll get a straddle, restraddle, restraddle again and get some some blood in the water. Maybe the poker gods will hear us out again since they only hear me out here 
as I'm commentating and not playing when I need them. Fish electing to raise and make it 17 out of the small blind. Chris defending out of the big blind with the four of diamonds and a mystery card. Queen Jack three, two hearts. No help to no one as of now. Ace of spades. Chris with the ace four taking down that pot. Fish has a ten dollar button straddle. Action will be on Chris in the small blind. Thank you guys for tuning in tonight, Wednesday evening here at Texas Card House RGV, where we do host every Wednesday night your one three Texas Hold'em three hundred dollar stream buy in game. And I welcome any of those who want to come out and play. You are more than welcome to make it out here, join on our jump on our list, and. Make your way onto this table, guys. Let's not forget about our Friday night streams. Every Friday from ten from six to ten PM, we do have a two five hold'em, five hundred men. We do have some action set up for you this Friday, guys. Back to the action we go. There was a ten dollar straddle. A couple of callers from this table and the table outside. Multi-way pot. King three King three deuce rainbow. Chris and Fish, the only ones holding a king. And Chris is in the small blind and does elect to lead out. He does have King Queen. Should find a couple of folds. Once again, guys, my apologies. We are lagging. Bear with me. Jack of spades on the turn. And I'm not sure what the turn, the action was on the turn, but we are off to a rivered queen of clubs. It is heads up. Chris does river king queen for two pairs. And I believe the action does go check, check. Once again, guys, I ask for your patience. We are having technical difficulties. We are still working out the kinks. Please bear with, with me. Be patient. The action will be coming, is coming. My apologies. If anybody's out on the main floor and wants to send a drink this way, more than happy and willing to take it.
off to a riverbed here by Chaos with the Jack-7 offsuit, telling a story. New York Bob is in the tank, holding pocket fours. He's playing aces and fours. Um, put one in the chat if you think Bob is going to call, or two if you think he's going to fold. I'm going to go with the one if I know New York Bob. He is ahead in this game, and he is pretty sticky. I do think New York Bob will make the call. Let me know what you think in the chat, guys. New York Bob does make the call, but we are seeing that there was a misread in Chaos's hand. He is holding the 5-7 offsuit for the better two pair. Nice call, a nice, I don't know, going on there, but Chaos does take down the pot. We are listening in to the table talk. It is getting a little. A little out there. That's for sure. White Wizard holding pocket nines. Electing to make a small min click to six. We are lagging, guys. I do apologize. Bear with me. We are trying our best to work out those kings. It does look like Geeky holding the ace jack. Not sure what's going on, guys. Give me one sec. Kika did raise the ace jack off to 16. New York Bob called the 16, and White Wizard, if I'm not mistaken, does four bet to 85 with the best hand. He is holding pocket nines, he is under the gun, and he was telling the story. Once again, guys, I do want to apologize. We are lagging on our end. It's we are trying our best to work out these kinks as we go. It is frustrating, and I do apologize. Once again, guys, I'm so sorry. I do apologize for the inconvenience. We are working diligently to get this back on track. OK, 
Okay, we do have action. Kike is all in. Ace Jack. And Richard with the pocket nines out ahead. They are running it twice, I believe.
Oh yeah, and then it was very good. Yeah. Very good that he's like the king on him. Right the board, right the board. Right the board. Fuck yeah!
What a car. I said just spit him up the border. No. He was praying. <laughs> <laughs> well, there we have some other end. He squeezed the chair. <laughs> he squeezed the chair. <laughs>
check make it easy? If we get too bumpy, this will start. <laughs> <laughs>